Today I'm making spinach soup that is creamy and very delicious. It is perfect for a western tea meal and goes very well with garlic bread or slider buns. This recipe is for 4 to 6 servings. Chop up 50 grams of garlic. And set aside in a bowl. Repeat with 280 grams of yellow onions. And set aside. Add 75 ml of water to 1.5 tablespoon of tapioca flour and mix until well combined. To make the flour slurry to thicken the soup, you can use cornstarch as well. Set aside. Switch on the heat to medium. In a medium-sized stock pot, add 45 grams of butter and melt completely. Add 50 grams of minced garlic and 280 grams of chopped yellow onions. Cook for 3 minutes or until translucent. Stir occasionally to prevent burning at the bottom of the pot. After 3 minutes, the pot is very fragrant. Add 1 liter of chicken stock, half tablespoon of thyme, 1 over 8 teaspoon of pepper, and 1 teaspoon of salt. Stir to mix all the ingredients. Cover the pot and let it boil for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, the soup is boiling vigorously. Add 550 grams of washed spinach by batch. So the bottom one will soften before more is added. Give it a stir if needed. This way, it will all fit in the stock pot. Cover the pot and cook for 10 minutes. Stir every 5 minutes or so to cook it evenly. After 10 minutes, the spinach is very soft now. Give it a taste. Delicious! The soup is sweet and has enough seasoning. More can be added if preferred. Switch off the heat. Blend it until the soup is a smooth liquid with a hand blender. If using a normal blender, let the spinach soup cool a little before blending. After about 2 minutes, the spinach soup is well blended. Add 200 ml of cooking cream. Switch on the heat to medium and stir for about 30 seconds or until the cream is fully combined with the soup. As it is quite thin, add the flour slurry and stir until well distributed. Give it a taste. Delicious! Switch off the heat and our creamy spinach soup is ready to be served. Let's eat! Smooth, creamy and sweet. The spinach is fresh and there is a hint of chicken in the soup. I like to dip it with butter bread and enjoy. So good! This is Home Cooking with Som Tip. Thank you and bye-bye!